Hey guys, if you're wondering why I didn't go to school today, that's because I had an orthodontist appointment this morning and there was really no point in me going to school for 20 minutes and then my mom checking me out. So, um, this morning I woke up, we went to go pick my brother up from school and then um, I went to my orthodontist appointment and then we went to my papa's house and then we went to the emergency room because my brother has like a scab on his ankle and he won't leave it alone and it's like really bad infected and the doctor gave us a cream to put on it and hopefully it'll be better um so that's why i didn't go to school today it's because there's really no point in me going and we were super busy today um also another little update uh, I think I have, I say oh a lot, in case you didn't realize that. Um, let's <laughs> change it up a little bit. Um, I think I have a spirit in my closet. Uh, you don't have to believe me if whenever I say this, but my mom saw a ghost. We, because whenever we used to live in the apartments, my mom saw a ghost. And we named this ghost Charlie because, you know, the, like, it's ironic because after we named our ghost Charlie, the Charlie Charlie challenge started spreading viral over the internet. And I was like, huh, that's kind of weird that we named a ghost Charlie and then the Charlie Charlie thing happened. Like, that just ruined my hair. But anyways, that was kind of weird. But weird things started happening in the apartment, and we figured it was a ghost because the cats would mess, like, would act up. And, you know, cats and dogs and animals can sense that kind of stuff. Like, if the storm is happening or if there's something present, uh, they can sense that kind of stuff. So we thought that we just had a ghost, and we named it Charlie, and my mom saw it. I'm trying to make a video, Titan. Could you itch somewhere else? Anyways, you don't have to believe me whenever I say this, but my mom actually saw Charlie. It's a girl. Um, she had long brown hair. And the like herself, she was wearing a nightgown. It was like really long, like from like the 1980s, like one of them type of nightgowns. So we think that it was like living there for a really long time. Um, and then um let's see, the she said that the ghost itself was like a green, silvery, shimmery kind of color. Um, um, and then weird things started happening here once we, w once we moved, um, like doors would open and my closet door keeps opening, which is why I think it's in my closet. Titan! Stop! It doesn't itch that bad! Okay. Anyways, like I was saying, okay, well, since my brother's not leaving, being annoying like always, um, like I was talking about, um, since I think I have a ghost in my closet, I think he left, but anyways, since I think I have a ghost in my closet, um, I decided to put four or five pieces of paper in my closet along with a few crayons. <clears throat> Get out. Out. So. So, like, if the, my mom's about to come in here, I think. No. But, um, so if the ghost wants to draw something, like a picture... Or if it wants to say something, it can. Um, so I put that in there, and I'm going to leave it in there for a few days to let the ghost reply. Um, so, yep, yeah, that's basically the update. I didn't go to school today. My brother went to the emergency room, put paper in my closet, and that's about it. Uh, I don't really have anything else to say. Um, but, yeah, that's just the quick update, and I guess I'll talk to you guys. Later. Bye.